literary school i am in first grade i am in first standard i live my city's name is pune i have three members in my family they are my mother my father and me and and one thing i play chess wow hello all happy evening do you know why i said happy evening because my name is harsh which means spreading happiness i study in mount lidlazi school wakar pune in school i like all the subjects but my favorite subject is mathematics i live with my parents my ma- papa and ma in the city which is known as oxford of east yes you guessed it right i'm from pune i like to play chess and skating and night is my favorite piece in the chess as it can jump over any piece i always won the best student award in the all grade grades when i grow up i want to be an astronaut and i will go on moon rathi and my story's name is anu learns to save the characters in my story are anu anni two girls two little girls anni and anu live in a tiny village near lontem goa they were the best of friends they went to the same school and they always played together the villagers were so fond of anni and anu as they were always willing to help people in return for all help for all the help the villagers would often reward the girls some gave them like small nick snacks some gave them snacks to eat and some even gave them coins one sunny sunday morning they had bolu the shepherd look after the sheep as they browsed browsed grazed happily on a grassy hill lock you girls are so kind and helpful said bolu and offered them each a tall glass of sweet milk one day they helped rani the flower lady to make a to make a nice garland rani was so happy with the girls that she gave them both beautiful roses one one day they helped rodrick the postman to sort out the letters in his post office rodrick gave them both five coins each and said buy some sweets with this children with the coins they got from rodrick they ran to the local sweet shop to buy kul kul anu used up every single one of her five coins but anni only used two and put the rest in her bag why are you putting the coins in your bag asked anu i'm saving them for another day said anni with a smile on her face anu was confused one day while running from school they saw michael the milkman michael was old and was struggling to carry the milk can please let us help you my uncle michael said anu i would love that anu dear but these are the only three cans of milk i have and i need to take it to the market safely 
said Michael. Promise, we will be careful with your milk can. Said Anu. All right, children, you can help me. Carry these two cans, said Michael, and handed them a milk can each. The three of them started walking towards the market. Swish! A cat crossed the road and startled little Anu. Eek! He screamed and jumped aside, knocking down both Annie and Michael. They all fell down and the milk was split on the ground. Anu, it's just a cat, said Michael in a sad voice, looking at the split milk. My cows are sick and these were the only three cans of milk I got this whole week. I had to sell them in the market to earn some money. What do I do now? said Michael. Anu felt trouble. I'm sorry, he cried. The three of them sat on the road feeling very sad. Idea, said Annie. All of a sudden. She, I have saved some coins, Uncle Michael. You can take them from me and give it back whenever you can, said Annie in, a, in an excited voice. That is really nice of you, Annie. This will help me a lot. But are you sure? Asked Michael. Yes, Uncle. I have saved my coins. For a day like this, you can take them today. You need it more than I do, said Annie. This is very kind of you, Annie, said Michael. Annie dug into her bag to find the coins and handed it over to Michael. While Michael walked away with the coins, Anu still felt trouble. But she was a quick realized why Annie did not buy kulkuls for all the coins the other day. Anu looked at her friend and said, Annie, now I understood why you saved those coins. You will always need some extra coins for a day like this. As they walked back towards their house, Anu said, I promise. I will always save some uh, some coins from today. Annie was glad that her best friend understood the importance of saving money. What I learned from story. Friends, would you like to share your views? I learned. I, from the story, I understood Importance of saving money regularly from a very early age. Thank you. Yay!